In this video, I will talk about the effect of area on capacitance, on electric field, on charge, and the energy stored. And in order to answer all this question, we will be using the capacitor lab simulation, which is from phase simulation. So here, I have uh, two metallic plates, which is connected to a battery. Right. So now let's see. And here I have set the the um, voltage, and we'll measure exactly what the voltage is or the uh, the supplied voltage. So now let's see first the the capacitance. So here is the capacitance. Okay. Now I'm changing the area. Changing the area. Let's see what is happening here. When I'm changing the area, the capacitance. If I increase the area the capacitance increases and this makes sense because when you have the two metal when, when the area of the plate is bigger that means this plate can hold more charges that's what the definition of capacitance is that means it can store more charge or it can store more electrical energy so the more the area of the plate is that means it has more uh, the area to store charge so the capacitance will increase. So mathematically, how we can answer this one is, you see the capacitance of a parallel plate capacitor is given by this relation. C is equal to A over D. As area increases, C increases as well because C is directly proportional to the capacitance is directly proportional to the area. The more the area is, the more the capacitance is. Okay. Now, let's talk to the second part now. What happens to the electric field? And again, we can measure the electric field here. Okay. So now we have an electric field detector. And you can place the electric field anywhere because this is the... Um, parallel plates so the electric field does not change with the distance okay and, and the electric field lines is always from positive to negative so now let's see what is happening here you can see right now the value is 47 volt per meter that's the value 47 volt per meter now I'm going to change the area and just keep an eye on to this one what's happening if, if I change the area, the electric flux, uh, the electric field does not change. The electric, although you see the more field lines here, but the electric field value is not changing. Why is that? Okay, so let me answer this question. So the electric field, if you look at the electric field, this is a formula for calculating the electric field. So electric field is given by potential difference divided by the distance between the plate. Here the distance between the plate is fixed and we are just changing the area. So the applied potential is not changing. So V is constant, D is constant, so electric field is also remains constant. So the electric field will not change if the area of the plate increases. Okay, And the other reason is so now your question will come up. So we see the more fill lines. It is a yes, true. The fill lines, the number of fill lines will increase because the area has increased. But the surface charge density won't change. If we change the area, the area changes. That means the charge changes. The amount of charge increases. But the charge density remains the constant. So the electric field is independent of the area of the plate. It depends upon the surface charge density, not on the area. Okay, now let's talk about to the, okay, let me answer this one here too. Uh, v is constant, D 
d is constant and and are independent of the area so electric field remains remains constant so the so electric field won't change okay now let's uh, now see what happens to the charge okay the plate charge here is the plate charge now let's see if I am decreasing the plate charge the plate if I increase the area the plate charge increases the plate charge increases that means with the area the charge charge onto the capacitor increases okay Now let's let's do it mathematically. So you see now this formula here Q is equal to VC. This is the formula. So the V is constant. V is not changing because this V is the potential difference. And we're not changing the potential difference. What is happening is the capacitance has now increased. The more the the area is the bigger the the capacitance is and you can see here too as the capacitance increases that means it has now more ability to store more charges and that's the reason when you increase the area the capacitance uh, capacitance increases which makes it to store more electrical charge okay the last one is what happens to the energy stored if the area of the plate increases okay so now let's talk about the energy stored here so now let me change the area if I change the area the energy stored increases the more the plate is the more the energy stored is and let me talk this one mathematically first so this is the energy stored formula So in this case, the V is the applied potential, which remains constant. It does not change, but the capacitance has increased because of the area. If we increase the area, the C increases, the capacitance increases. That means the energy stored increases as well. Okay. So the energy stored will also also increases so this is the effect of the the area of the plate onto the capacitance electric field charge and the energy stored again if you have any questions please write your questions in the comment section below and do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you so much